since I was able to bring you a video. <clears throat> I think the last one was back in June or July, which was the um, final episode of my barn owl saga, trying to find and photograph a barn owl. And uh, since then, basically shortly after that last video, um, I fell ill and um, ended up needing an operation and that knocked me out for a few months. And then Following that, we went back into lockdown and tier systems, and you all know the story. Um, so, yeah, and the, basically the long and the short of it was that pretty much all of my commissioned work was cancelled uh, last year, and that being the case, I couldn't afford to keep my place in Oxford. So I ended up packing my bags, put everything in the car, and I drove down to Greece. Um, because at least here I can live a lot cheaper than back in the UK. And uh, I've been here for a few weeks now. Um, again, this country is uh, locked down, so movement has been really difficult for me. But I'm finally up at Lake Kirikini. And I've spent the last couple of days shooting some uh, footage of the um, Dalmatian pelicans here for... Um, uh, production company back in the UK that's making a uh, documentary on European wildlife so that's been fun and I've got a few more days work with them uh, in the coming uh, few days now um, but this morning I'm out and about on my own account uh, and it's lovely to be out with my own cameras um, it's about an hour before dawn now the edge of the lake so I'm just waiting for the light to happen and hopefully get some flamingos and waders and uh, ducks and we'll see what else uh, maybe another pelican or two uh, anyway it's a little bit looks like it's a bit socked in on the horizon there but we might get a gap in the clouds to give us some decent light we'll see um, but uh, regardless of light conditions uh, I'm just so happy to be out Anyway, so hopefully I'll catch up with you in a little bit uh, with something interesting in frame and some beautiful light. So I shall see you then. so it looks like the sun is about to come up there's the thinnest of slivers 
of a gap on the horizon, so I'm hoping that the um, sun will at least very briefly peek through and uh, light up the clouds which are all overhead uh, above me right now. So there's a chance it might um, give me some nice light. But there's absolutely no birds in front of me whatsoever. There's a large flock, which I don't know if you might be able to pick up on this microphone, way over to the left on the other side of the bay. And I think the reason basically is we've had a lot of rain and thunderstorms the last few days here. And the um, water level has risen dramatically. And in fact, it's rising as I've been here. I've had to come bring the hide back uh, a few meters uh, because just in that time the uh, water moved in and I was sitting in water. So um, yeah, I don't know if that's the reason or perhaps because I shuffled the hide back a little bit. If there was any birds, I couldn't see any at, the, at that time uh, close by. I might have uh, spooked them. Uh, but um, anyway, yeah, there's absolutely nothing in front of me. Um, still, I'll give it another couple of hours probably uh, once the sun comes up and see if anything approaches. But um, it's absolutely beautiful morning. It's, the light is absolutely gorgeous. And um, yeah, so I'm hopeful that something will come along. Uh, we'll see. So, uh, in the event, the sun didn't uh, actually make uh, much of an appearance, but there was some nice light, and uh, unfortunately most of the birds have stayed very far away, uh, not helped by the fact that the fishermen have just arrived to recover their boat that has floated off. So, um, yeah, nevertheless, absolutely beautiful morning. Um, not much to speak of in the way of photos. I've managed to get some, some video um, and hopefully you'll enjoy seeing that. But um, yeah, I think I'm going to call it there because uh, like I said, the uh, fishermen have arrived and making a bit of a noise and very unlikely that anything is going to come uh, with them walking around nearby. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Again, apologies, it's been so long since the last video. Uh, hopefully in the next few weeks I'll be making a few more. Uh, I'll be doing a few excursions uh, around the lake here. I can't go that far because of the um, it's a very strict lockdown here in Greece and we need permits and everything to move around. Um, but uh, hopefully where I'm going to try and get to uh, it's not going to be um, that bad in terms of uh, getting there up in the mountain and around the lake. So. Um, I hope you stay tuned, uh, thanks for watching again, and uh, hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye for now.